Hi guys, hello there, my name is Daniel Danet, I'm an artist and I moved to England almost one year ago. Before that I lived in Russia and lived in Kazakhstan in a while. So right now I'm gonna visit a shop, buy some art stuff something and i will show you my city and just i uh, walk around the city something like that it's my first channel in english and let's start to the beginning last year i moved a new city and a new country for me sheffield england i had never been to england but for some reason i always dreamed of moving here i don't know exactly what attracted me here Perhaps a vibe of politeness and especially the art. Hello. Hello. I am Daniel Daniel. Who are you? I am from future. What? And I know and now the frame will change where are you are sitting on the bench and talking. So when I first time moving to UK, I was staying in London the first year. And in London I lived in so many hostels, I don't know, like five, six hostels. I just changing every day one hostel by one hostel. And um, so London is very, very beautiful, very fantastic, fantastic. It's a lot of galleries, a lot of contemporary art everywhere, uh, the architect. So a lot of things, uh, it's a parties, uh, concerts, uh, it's very creative city, it's very interesting, very big city, it's, uh, I like it, it's a lovely city. Yeah. For my situation, I need to find a job and find accommodation for one week or, or two week maximum, uh, because uh, I, I had no money, <laughs> I had, I don't know, uh, 300 pounds I can even pay in rent for accommodation for flat even not a month and uh, I, I got it after one week I found it as uh, a job I found it the accommodation and it was free accommodation and um, but it was in Sheffield and that's because I'm here <laughs> and that's because I'm in Sheffield so that's my story <laughs> When I arrived in Sheffield, which was like a frustration because uh, after the London, that city uh, looked like uh, I don't know, super simple, not interesting city. But of course, I didn't see all city. So right now, right now, I really like my city. It's so nice, so cute, very quiet and uh, small city so it's very safety uh, so very nice city i think in the first months i definitely didn't fit into the surrounding society it felt like uh, i was in a different world and and literally in another planet i learned to speak and perform my actions often thinking i was doing something wrong even entering a store, I didn't understand what product where and didn't translate everything from the names, buying the wrong things and having to throw them away. In the second and third months, I worked on creative projects to relax from the stress and even participate in a local group exhibition at Frontier Gallery. In the following month, I communicated a bit better in English, but there were very strong mood swings from very cheerful to complete depression. I attended concerts, worked in art projects, participated in exhibitions, met friends, but all of it ended very quickly. Unfortunately, most of the time I spent alone. I enjoy working on art projects, it motivated me a lot, but life itself is quite boring. <laughs> Boom. And this is my studio, this is my workshop, mini workshops, this is my table. No, it's me, you know that. This is my art. Do you like my art? Do you like? No? You don't like? This year was very wonderful. It was a lot of 
for interesting project, a lot of interesting people, a lot of different city. I'm very excited about that, really. Uh, so it was exhibition, exhibition in London, two street art festivals. I was very, I'm very excited about that. Yeah. Always when the next year started, I usually uh, create some goals for the next year and I create a kind of list about my projects, uh, about some open calls. I've got uh, two projects, I'm doing the projects right now. On the next year, in 2024, I want a personal exhibition. Yeah, just write me below. <laughs> And of course, I will be participating in some open calls, and you can see that it's kind of list. I always have uh, this kind of list. It's very, it's very easy to use that. It's very easy to introduce your art uh, somewhere and create very interesting projects. So yeah, something like that. Uh, it's my blog, and of course, uh, you can write below. Um, leave the comments what's the topic you would like to see from my channel guys and of course i will do that because it's my my video blog i don't have a choice thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next video so 